when the heat is entering into the system so water is becoming heated getting heated so q will be positive from 10 to 40 10 to 100 10 to 200 matters right and this c is very important as well the following video is a part of the dreamer package in case you find the video helpful and want to watch more such videos like adiabatic process efficiency of thermodynamic cycle internal energy ic engines lubrication system etc find the link of the dreamer package in the description box below you can also check out our courses on merchantnavydecoded.com all the content on the merchant navy decoded website aims at helping you get selected in a good shipping company or college helping you get faster promotions but most importantly guide you to earn respect on ship jai mata di guys i am going to talk about heat acha ek cheez main aap logo ko advice dena chahunga suppose when you go for an interview and the interviewer asks you say what is heat so don't try to impress interviewer by giving a uh, definition which has got very high five words why the moment you do that your interviewer wants to know ki bhai definition ka matlab kya hai and definitely by giving all those high five words you are giving you are screwing up yourself because then you'll get into those details rather impressing you are getting into depression so use simple words make it as simple as possible but try to impress in interviewer by making him understand that your basic concepts are clear your thinking is good okay so when i talk about heat interaction between system and surrounding because of temperature difference between them when they communicate so he can straight away ask you what is the system and what is the surrounding so you need to know that ki sir when i talk about a glass and the water is there the water is a system and the outside is a surrounding simple but you need to know that कि भाई सिस्टम की डेफिनेशन क्या है सराउंडिंग की डेफिनेशन क्या है बिकॉज दैट इज हाउ योर इंटरव्यू स्टार्ट्स देन ही कैन आस्क यू सर ओके व्हाट इज द फॉर्मूला इज सर क्यू इज इक्वल टू एन सी डेल्टा टी यू मीन ओके व्हाट इज एन इज सर नंबर ऑफ मोल्स हाउ इज दैट इंपॉर्टेंट सर इफ दिस इट इज 1 मोल तो हाउ मच इट इफ 10 मोल्स हाउ मच इट 50 मोल्स हाउ मच इट राइट सो नंबर ऑफ मोल्स इज इंपॉर्टेंट व्हाट इज डेल्टा टी सर फर्स्ट थिंग इफ आई हैव टू हीट From 100 degree centigrade, if I have to uh, say heat is flowing from 100 to 0 degree centigrade, what happens? Initially, it flows very fast. Say from 100, it reduces to 75, and it becomes 25 in say five minutes. Okay. Then from 75 to 65, and this becoming 35, it takes 10 minutes. Then from 65 to 50, and it also becomes 50, it takes 30 minutes. So, what is happening? You see, heat flow is more and temperature difference is more. And second thing is, say, now guys, this is water, but imagine this cube of gas, okay? This is 1 kg water, this is 10 kg water, okay? Hit it. Heat this 1 kg water from 0 degree centigrade to 100 degree centigrade and heat this also from 0 degree centigrade to 100 degree centigrade which will require more heat this one because over here this is 10 kg and mass is there so when your Q your heat is being talked about mass matters in case of gas number of moles matter when I talk about delta T see if I have to take from 0 to 100 and I have to take 1 kg over here and 1 kg over here and this one from 0 to 50 0 to 50 jaldi aa jayega yaar it will take a lot of time so heat energy required over here is less as compared to over here so it depends on difference in temperature how much heat you have given temperature kahan se kahan tak leke gaye from where to where from 10 to 40 10 to 100 10 to 200 matters right and this c is very important as well bhai c when I was heating 1 kg from 0 to 100, say it took me 350 joules energy, okay? And when I was heating 10 kg from 0 to 100, it took me 3500 joules. Make sense? So mass is over here, delta T is over here. What is the difference which is changing this? This is C. What is it say? Molar specific heat of gas. अगर मैं यहां पर गैस मानू इन केस ऑफ लिक्विड मोलर स्पेसिफिक हीट 
oh sorry what i'm saying not molar but specific heat of liquid okay in case of liquids uh, gases it is molar specific heat of gas okay so what is it quantity of heat required to raise the temperature of unit mass say 1 kg by 1 degree centigrade in case of gas it is 1 mole so it is like unitary method ki bhaiya 1 degree centigrade banana hai 1 kilo ka to this much heat is required if it is 10 kg multiply by 10 Now, if I have to raise it by 20 degrees, then I have to multiply it by 20 degrees. Confused? Okay, I'll repeat it again. Again, this says molar specific heat of gas. कि भाई I have got say for one mole, if I have to raise temperature by one degree centigrade. One mole, if I have to raise temperature by one degree centigrade, then how much? Say I need 350 joules. Okay? Now I say no, sir. I have got three fifty joules. Okay. Now I say, sir, I do. This is C. Okay. Now I say, sir, I do not have one mole. I have got ten moles. Oh, say, oh, got ten moles by one degree centigrade. Okay, I have to multiply it by ten, sir. Now, sir, I do not have to raise the temperature by one degree centigrade of these ten moles. I have to increase it by ten degree centigrade. अच्छा, ten moles. By 10 degree centigrade. Okay, 350 into 10 into 10. That is how you get this formula. Okay. Now this is a basic formula, and guys, this basic formula is going to be helpful when I talk about reefer system as well. The only difference is this N will become mass, C will remain C, and delta T will remain delta T. Okay, guys. Thank you very much. This is all about heat. Yes, one thing is remaining, and that is. When I talk about Q, Q will be positive when the heat is entering into the system. So water is becoming heated, getting heated. So Q will be positive because heat under our system is. But Q will be negative if heat is being is leaving the system. So if the water is at hundred degree centigrade and outside temperature is zero degree centigrade, so basically water is going to become cool. it is going to give heat q is going to be negative okay guys this is all you have to remember in these positive and negative signs whether of work done or q and later i'm going to talk about internal energy are going to be important when i talk about first law of thermodynamics thank you very much jai mata if you found the video helpful do not forget to like share and subscribe to our channel to watch more such technical videos click on the playlist given on the screen and find the link of the dreamers package in the description box below Thank you.